now that we have our course completed, it is time to publish our course. In order to do that, go to the publish button. You'll get this pop up. Most of the time you will publish using the LMS option. Now for teachers, we should be somewhat familiar with what an LMS is, which means learning management system. Make sure that the title is the title of your course. For the LMS output, you can just set it as default, which is SCORM 1.2. Make sure you know which folder your course is published at. The easiest place to find your course is to publish to your desktop, and we'll do that now. Then click publish. Now, before you view your project, you want to zip the course so that you don't forget. Then view your course. What you want to do now is go through the course and make sure that there are no errors and that everything is functioning properly. If you need to make changes, you can go back to Storyline and modify, then republish. Great job, you have created your first e-learning module. Next, we'll move to uploading a course into a learning management system. 